Shalom, Shalom, Shalom. First and foremost, I would like to give all praises to the Most High Yahweh, Bahashem Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Bruka Kodash. Then I would like to send my double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, GMS, for having taught me this truth, which is the 100% truth, and also for ruling well. And peace and salutations to the hopeful elect spread around the four corners of the earth. Unto those who are laboring in the vine in these last days, Shalom. Uh, yeah, Esau actually got my my channel on 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 a hold, you know, for over two weeks. I think two weeks. Yes. So since two weeks, I've not been able to post on this channel. I've been posting on my backup channel, which is this Yarayaya Sharala. So if you'd like to subscribe to this channel you know you can go on and subscribe to the channel it's called yaraya sharala this is my backup channel because this is the this is the second strike i'm i'm getting and i got an email if i get the third strike um i wouldn't be able to make use of the channel anymore so anyway this is just still part of the whole plan of the most high yahweh bashem yahweh shai the time is coming where we'll all people will seek for this truth and would not be able to find it as written in the book of um, Amos 8, 11. So, you know, um, this Edomites, you know, the ruling class and also two thirds of the house of Israel who are partaking and helping them carry out their agenda. You know, they'll be trying to hide the truth, you know. So, you know, as you all know, the Most High has said his people to bring out this truth and i'm grateful i'm most grateful to the most high yahweh bashem yahweh shai for having you know given given me the understanding to understand this truth which is a blessing you know so this truth is going to be the stability of our times and the times we're about to get into because those people are actually making different laws and changing stuffs you know um they're calling what's right wrong and yeah, let's quickly get it from the scripture that I've prepared here, which is the book of um, Isaiah chapter 5 verse 20, which quotes, Woe unto them that call evil good and good evil, that put darkness for light and light for darkness, that put bitter for sweet and sweet for bitter. Woe unto them that are wise in their own eyes and prudent in their own sight. Yeah, this is actually talking about the house of the wicked and um, including israelites as well two thirds of the israelites you know those 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 ones that are helping them you know to carry out their agenda you know so they're actually calling good evil they've been blocking different apostles with different elders they've been blocking their channels you know for doing what just for preaching the truth just for teaching the truth you know so the truth has now become hate speech the truth has now become um deceptive as they call it the truth the truth has now become um fake news as they call it you know so this is exactly what the scriptures is talking about you know woe unto them that call evil good and good evil that put darkness for light and light for darkness that put bitter for sweet and sweet for bitter you know they actually they, they believe they are wise in their eyes you know woe unto them that are wise in their own eyes and prudent in their own sight you know they actually believe that they're being wise, you know, so as to push their agenda, which is the real lie, you know. So these people, they're in for a rude awakening, you know. The most high Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai, um, willing, you know, the time is going to be short. And we are actually praying and, you know, hoping this year, this year could be the last one, you know. So, you know, all those people, they actually believe that they're doing they're doing um they're carrying out their their plans you know they have their plans and they believe things are going well as planned but they don't know that they are actually going to fail they wouldn't be able to carry out the whole plan just like written in the book of um psalms i can't remember what chapter now is it 10 you know that talks about you know the wicked believes that his household is going to be forever you know so yeah let's Quickly get the book of um, Psalm 83. This is not actually the scripture I wanted I was talking about, but this also 
has something to do with what I'm speaking about. 83 verse, I believe. Okay, this is what they've actually been saying, you know, the house of the wicked. They have said, come and let us cut them off from being a nation, that the name of Israel may be no more in remembrance, you know. For they have consulted together with one consent. They are confederate against thee. The tabernacles of Adam and the Ishmaelites of Moab and the Hagarines, you know. This is exactly what they've been doing. You know, from verse 8 on 3 says, They have taken crafty counsels against thy people and consulted against thy hidden ones. And this is exactly what, you know, the so-called ruling class of the world, the elites, this is what they've been doing, you know, trying to prevent the truth from getting into the four corners of the earth. But guess what? They're just too late because the truth is already all around, you know. And we believe by the spirit of the Most High, Yahweh Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, you know, the Most High is already, I believe the Most High must have sealed these people already, you know. If, if, if he hasn't sealed all the all his people, you know, there are going to be only a few left to be sealed, you know. And there is nothing impossible for the Most High to do. Even if they take off this medium, the internet, you know, shut down all YouTube or whatever, the truth is still going to get to whom the truth has been destined to get to, you know. So these are this this is what this um the house of the wicked they've been doing, you know. The Edomites, you know, which are the so-called Caucasian, the so-called white man, the Ishmaelites, the Arabs, the Moabs, the Chinese, and the Agarines, these are the Africans, you know. They've been they've been all taking different counsel, you know, that's partaking to the um to that NATO that they formed, you know, they formed the NATO where they, they, they meet up and have different meetings and stuff, you know, they consult, but they ain't never consulting anything good for the house of Israel. They're only consulting stuff to cut them off from being a nation that the name of Yasharala may be no more in remembrance, you know, and the Most High Yehovah Hashem, our Shah is going to bring all their plans to north, you know. So this is actually time for the house of Israel, you know, to wake up, you know, wake up and, you know, wake up and, you know, seek the Lord with all your heart because the time is coming where we wouldn't be able to send out this truth anymore, you know. The Most High is going to shut our mouth and take away the spirit of teaching this truth, you know. And he's going to use all different means, you know, this Esau is going to chase us out of um of YouTube, like over here in Italy, they're coming up with different laws of, you know, this fake news stuff and everything like that, you know, all just to prevent the truth from spreading around, you know. So I'm calling on to you, the sons of Yasharala, to the one Todd who have been ordained from the beginning to accept this truth. You know, we are actually preaching this truth and teaching you and telling you, you know, to repent, to accept this truth, to come out of of these false doctrines, you know, these false religions, you know, that Esau has put all around, this fake illusion, come out of them and seek the true, true power, which is Yahweh, you know, and his son, Yahweh Shai, who the word ignorantly called Jesus, you know, there is no salvation in any other thing apart from this name, you know. And the time is short, you know, as we can see, our prophecies are playing and there is no much more time, you know. The most I could, you know, let it go this year, you know. So, you know, many people, you know, they get to listen to this truth and they just take it for granted. You know, you try to teach certain people, they they think maybe it's just a joke or they, they think maybe you're bugged out or something, you know. Well, let's quickly get the book of... um. Book of Matthew twenty four. Okay. So as we can see, verse fourteen it says, and this gospel 
of the kingdom shall be preached in all the world for witness unto all nations. Then shall the end come. As a matter of fact, you know, out of all the Hebrew Israelite groups that we have, you know, it's only GMS, Great Meal Stone, that has um the full truth and GMS Great Meal Stone, we are the only people we are the only group that's you know, we have different camps out out of the United States. You know, you have camps in um in, in Germany, you have camps in, in Holland, over here in Italy, you have camps in Australia, you know, this truth is getting all around. You have camps in Nigeria, you have camp in um Tanzania, you know, this truth is getting all around. You know, through the internet, this truth is getting all around. You know, it's being preached. You know, people can listen to the truth anytime they want. You know, so this prophecy is already coming. You know, so the the echo. This is the point I actually. No, oh, the point I want to get through is. Is here. Okay, which quotes? Matthew twenty four thirty seven, but as the days of Noah were, so shall also the coming of the Son of Man be. For as in the days that were before the flood, they were eating, drinking, marrying, and giving in marriage, until the day that Noah entered into the ark, you know, and knew not until the flood came and took them all away. So shall also the coming of the Son of Man be, you know. Now. These people, they're actually promising and, you know, promising this fake illusion, this fake peace, you know. Like, they're coming up with different, 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 different laws every day, you know, giving people illusion of, of a future, you know. Everyone is already, everyone is, um, is believing and, you know, ex expecting to, to have economy grow back, you know, for things to go back to normal and all these stuff, you know, it's just an illusion, you know. And this is just taking the mind of the people away from the day of the Lord, Yahweh Shai, you know. So many people are still going to be in the hustle, grinding, you know, trying to seek some stupid career, you know, trying to make some as much money as they can, you know, build houses and drive the Lamborghini, you know. This is the dream of many of y'all, you know. And... There is no time. These are just illusions, you know. And what happened during the time of Noah? Noah was actually preaching to these people and telling them, you know, there is a flood coming. The people were looking at him and, you know, calling him all sorts of names and thinking maybe he was bugged out and crazy, man. How are you going to say something like that, you know? Until the day that the flood came down, they all ran in. They wanted to partake and go into the ark with him, but it was too late. And this is just going to be the same thing that is going to happen. Only that this time around, the flood is not going to be by water. It's going to be by fire, you know. There is a third world war, you know, at the door, which the most high Yahweh Bashem Yahweh has prepared all these nations against themselves. They're going to flood this fire, you know, via nuclear bomb, you know. If your name is not found written in the book of life, and we are actually praying every day, the most high Yahweh Ba Hashem Yahweh Shai be merciful upon our souls and have our names, you know, written in the book of life. But on unto those who don't know this name and they're not seeking his name, man, you're in for a rude awakening, man. You know? So anyway, I just wanted to do this lesson, you know, saying that, you know, I can post videos on this channel. I'm back and I'll start doing more videos until, you know. Until they get us off this channel, you know. But well, this time around, I'll try to be more careful, so this channel could, you know, could remain because I have lots of videos that I've, I've done on this channel in Italian, and also in English, you know, which can edify and help many brothers, you know. I've done the deeper teachings, you know, behind, so, it's going to be painful if they take this channel away, but, it's it's no problem, you know. It's if it is the will of the most high Yahweh Ba Hashem Yahweh Shai, that is will be, you know, it's not a problem, you know. So well, remember this is my second channel, my backup channel, you know, this is my backup channel. If you want to subscribe, you know, I've been putting out some videos on it, you know, in Italian and also in English, you know. 
having said having said this i hope someone is edified this day by this short video and i'd like to give all praises to the most high yahweh bahashem yahweh shai bahashem ruka kudash and i'd like to send my double honors to the apostles and elders of great millstone gms for having taught me this truth which is the 100 percent truth peace and salutation to the hopeful elect of the house of yasharala shalom